On this Friday's Travel and Young, we're going to Spin Bowl. We're the Youngs. We've spent our lives traveling the world. And in 2018, we moved from Chicago, Illinois, to Copenhagen, Denmark. Now we want to share with you how our new lives abroad is keeping us young. Keeping us young. Are helping to keep us young. Hello, welcome to this Hi. Friday's Travel and Young, and we are in Svinborg, Denmark. Well, almost, not quite, yeah, but... we're on this super cute island of Tosinga. I think I said that right, and we are staying at this very cute Airbnb here that Josh picked out for us for this weekend. Yeah, it's really cute. We'll, we'll do a tour around it yeah. in a little bit, um, but I will say beforehand that I've hit my head on the beams a few times. The <laughs> ceilings are a bit low, but it's still really nice and very cool. I found it because we wanted to get away yeah. and, and, and spend a weekend here in Svinborg because, well, people have said we need to, plus we yes. actually have been here briefly once before. Last year during our trip to Eru, which is a video that I'll post up above, um, we stayed the night in Svinborg downtown yeah. and all we did was sleep and then get up and take the ferry. We did nothing else. <laughs> no we've exploring. Been wanting to come back. Yeah, so now is our chance to explore. So let's go, go down to the harbor and see what we find. <laughs> One of the reasons why we came this weekend is because these boats are doing this special race. You can see some behind me where they basically race around the island of Fjun. And I know they do this a couple times with different sized boats, but the ones this weekend are just one person on their boat themselves. So behind me, you'll see some are actually coming in. Um, they left yesterday um, and here we are getting to see some of them come in. So we thought we'd come down and we're gonna check out the boat museum in a minute but we wanted to see these boats. That's one reason why we picked this weekend. So let's go ahead and see if we can maybe see some more boats. I don't know, there's one that I'll let Miranda kind of show, <laughs> maybe yeah. zoom in a little bit. Yeah. Look at that guy. Pretty cool and there's like quite a few actually in the background there. But uh, behind me is the museum for Lustesluz, Sluz. <laughs> Lusa, boats. Yeah. And so we're going to go check that out right now here in Svinborg. Standing here in front of the Stormy 2, which is quite a famous boat here for Denmark. Um, this boat was owned by Sven Billesbule, uh, and he circumnavigated the world in this boat. We can see the, the path that he took to go around the world. It took him seven years to make this trip. Um, he had made the trip once before in a boat that was also called Stormy, um, but this was his second time. And so it's pretty incredible that you can come here and see the actual boat and you can go in it if you want. So it's pretty cool. because brisket can't contain himself in this place. What are you doing? <laughs> so this is the super cute Airbnb that we got. Um, it's a great summer place. It's relaxing. We have a nice living room. And if we go back here and try not to hit your heads on these beams, um, there's a bedroom, which Obviously, we've been sleeping in. And then there's... <laughs> and then there's 
a nice table here that we've sat at. This is where we did one of our tried on Tuesdays. And there's a nice kitchen um, to prepare anything that you would like to prepare. Um, and it's big enough for a weekend, so it has everything you need. Um, and then, come back here again, watch the beams. Uh, you have a nice extra room with a nice little couch. If Maya had come, she could have yeah, slept in Yeah, she could have slept on this. But she did not. <laughs> And then we have this beautiful bathroom, which I absolutely love. It's very uh, Scandinavian spa-like. Yeah, nice. we got to talk about these little notes. <laughs> so this is so cool. The person who leaves these little notes. Yeah, so you know what to do. Um, my personal favorite is this one. There's this one. But there's also um, this one, which translates in English to don't use a lot of toilet paper because the toilet is delicate. <laughs> it's, yeah. it's a delicate flower. Yeah, so there's a bunch of just random spots where there's these little notes, which I think is just a nice... Yeah, it's nice. And it shows, you know, a little bit of which touch. What supposed to do? It's nice little personalized notes around yes. a few different spots in a few different places that give you instructions <laughs> on what to do. And it's very relaxing oh, here. Oh, good news, I oh, just hit my head. <laughs> oh, uh, and of course, what is a vacation spot without a fireplace? We yes. did not use this. We were really only here for two nights. And I've seen these a few places since oh. we've been here. If you know where I can get one of these, let me know because this is super cool. I would love yeah. one of these crates. That's super cool. I've seen this one and then I saw some at the boat museum as well. And then lastly, there's this foyer, so we can take our shoes off, lead brisket, and there you go. This is, uh, there's a ladder with, <laughs> with a whole, lots, of, with lots of notes on this one. I think this is the entry of all note-taking yeah. firewood, which we didn't use, but yeah, yeah. really neat place here, and it's just uh, it 10 minutes to spend, I mean, brisket is just, loves it. Yeah. he needs a bigger living room, because he's just... <laughs> Having a blast. <laughs> yeah. Brisket's leading the way. He is. He's excited to not be in the car right now. Yeah. And here we are. Oh, Lord. See how we can get a little closer to the water brisket. It's a bit windy. <laughs> Super windy. You can probably hear the wind more than me. I think Brisket enjoyed himself, but now it's, it's, his, it's his least favorite part. The thing he hates the most, getting back in the car. And we always want to make sure he's safe, so we keep him in a crate. And he absolutely hates this, so. He cannot stand it, but it was a fun walk regardless. He is. had a blast. Let's see if we can find some beer. Ooh, beer. Hello, here we are Hi. in uh, in like kind of like a central part of Svenborg yeah. with brisket here. And we're right in front of the St. Nikolai Kirka. St. Nikolai's Kirka. 
We, so, uh, yeah, we drank some beer and I didn't did. get any footage of that. No. <laughs> um, because I was busy drinking beer and eating, uh, eating a chicken sandwich. Yeah, we had really good food. It's really nice and nice and quiet. I mean, obviously it's a Sunday, so kind of everything is closed. So it might have been nice to come up yesterday, but we were busy doing other things. So yeah, we went up to Unsa for a bit. So that's another yeah. video that you'll see at some point in the future. I don't know when we're gonna do this one first, but yeah. um, anyway, it was still a nice weekend, yeah, and we kind of like to find time to relax. We had a really nice Airbnb, as you saw, that was nice yeah. to relax at <laughs> and to sit and get your lick, ears licked by brisket. Super <laughs> relaxing. <laughs> But seeing the boats and stuff in the harbor oh, was, was cool. Oh, that was so much fun. Yeah, it was really neat. I wish we had seen Della the Dolphin. Yeah. But no, Maybe in a no luck. Trip. <laughs> All right, well, a couple important things. This Sunday coming up in just a couple days from now is the live stream. Yes. The 26th at 8 p.m. or uh, 20. 20. Just 20. 20. Just 20. <laughs> Danish, Central European time, yes. Danish time. Be prepared for the live stream. If you have any questions, you've been submitting some in yeah, comments, but add some, some more in comments ones. below. Obviously, we're going to do our best to answer them during the live stream as well, but yeah. it goes kind of fast. So it's good to have some things prepared ahead of time. So please give us some comments now if you uh, think about it. That'll be helpful. Yeah. And we're looking forward to that. Brisket's looking forward to that. Maya's <laughs> looking forward to that. Everybody's looking forward to that. Yep. Um, yeah. So there you go. Yep, we had to go got ahead. Some, got some exciting videos on the way. Some we're surprises. Not gonna, we're not going to give away anything yet. But uh, one will do a nice little promotion during the live stream, so make sure to watch yes. to see what that's about because it's a special video that's uh, coming up pretty soon. Yep, definitely. Okay. All right. Well, Time I think to go. we're gonna. We need to jump in the car, <laughs> drive back home. Poor brisket. Not looking forward to that at all. He doesn't know, but the second he sees the car, he doesn't like he's it. He's gonna get it's, terrified. It's his least favorite thing, and I think he hates it more than Josh hates the Nightmare Bridge. Which we also have to drive yeah, over because we we're on fun right now, and I got to go over the bridge to get home. So no one's gonna enjoy the drive home. <laughs> well, we're really close. You can almost see the Nightmare <laughs> yeah, Bridge from yeah, here. It's not far can. from here, so that's just like 30 minutes in, and then I'm done with that. Yeah. But anyway. Right. There you go. That was it from Spinboard. We'll be back again to do other Definitely. things that we didn't get to do. Yep. We just kind of relaxed and chilled, but it's all good. This yeah. is a cool relaxing. This is part of being vacationing in Denmark is yeah. just chilling and relaxing and not being stressed to do a thousand things. You know what it is? It's Huga. It's Huga on it's vacation. Huga. It's very Hugely. Our weekend Huga yep. trip to Spinboard. Yes. <laughs> All right. Thanks for joining us and stay tuned for sure. Catch the live stream and that's it for today. We'll see you later. Bye-bye.